spend about two hours a day cutting the park, uh, feed it when it needs fed, make sure there's no weeds kicking about. Just I always look after the ground at the park so it's quite set forward. Change the heights in the summer. Oh yeah, there's nothing better on a Friday walking in the door still like that. Probably morning. <laughs> but if we get dry weather like now it's well I say the like it's raining. But uh, <laughs> the dry weather weather we've had has been a problem trying to get water onto the park. We've not got any kind of system here, it's just get what we can onto the park basically. Of course, the well kept playing surface is one thing, but nothing in Brecon is more famous than Glebe Park's iconic hedge with followers from across the globe. Brecon also have their own feline mascot in the form of Glebe Park's resident cat. Uh, any visitors that come in, that's the first place to head to the hedge to get their photo taken. People come from all over the world to see it. There's guys in from New Zealand a couple of years ago just to get their photo taken in front of the hedge. So yeah, it's, it's out there like the, the world knows about it. <laughs> I used to belong to the church and they used to grow their crops here at one time. So I could go back hundreds of years. Yeah. Dolly the cat, I, she, she's been here about maybe eight, nine years now. Um, she appeared during the, the first league game against Rangers and she's never left. <laughs> she's just stayed. Yeah. Great wee thing. <laughs>